everyone, welcome back to my channel, Health Ignite Fitness. Today is going to be your day three. We're going to be doing abs. We're going to do a quick warm up. Then we're going to do your workout, which is going to be 15 reps per exercise for three sets. And then we're going to do a quick cool down. You can join me and we're going to start with your warm up. You can walk in one place. Shaking out everything, getting everything loose. And you're going to stand with your feet further than hip width spot. You're going to lift up your right and your left arm. And you're going to stretch over towards the side. Start. 
Switch sides. And start. towards the side. Crunching. You can start.
and relax. Your next exercise, you're going to come down onto the floor, we're going to be doing sit-ups. I'm going to be using my plate for this workout, but you can also use your dumbbells. You're going to push your low back into the floor, and then you're going to be lifting up. As you come towards the top, you're going to breathe up. Hold your breath as you lower back down. And then as you're down, you're going to inhale. Hold your breath. 
exhale. You can start. While you're busy resting, you can lift one leg up at a time, engaging your lower ab muscles. So make sure that your lower back is pushed into the floor.
can start.
and start. You can grab a quick drink of water or take a longer break here and then you can join me and we're going to carry on with your workout. Your next exercise, we're going to be doing windmills. So you can grab a hold of both your weights. You're going to stand with your right foot forward and your left foot turned out. You're going to engage your glutes and your core. Lift up your right arm towards the top and you're going to lower down with your left hand without moving your hips. You're going to keep everything contracted and you're going to lower down, engaging your, both your oblique muscles. So you'll crunch this side and feel it stretching this side. And then come up. So you can start. towards your spine and lower down.
device. Your second seat. And start.
and relax. The next exercise, we're going down on the floor again and we're going to be doing bed bugs. You lie on your back. which I'm going to be doing in the second set. My triceps are still a little bit stiff from day one's exercise, so lowering down is quite painful. So I want to focus more on using my ab muscles, so I'm going to be making sure that I contract that. Otherwise I feel the pain in my arms, but then I don't feel my abs working. You can do your second set. Remember, low back into the floor, belly button in towards your spine. You can start. Don't use your legs and your arms. If 
if you feel that you're not contracting your muscle, put your right leg down and then make sure that you engage your core as you lower down and bring your leg in. So then you'll keep it on the floor instead of leaving it in the air. So then you basically do a crunch. You can do your third set. Next exercise is going to be reverse crunches. So you're going to put your arms next to your sides and you're going to bring your feet up, crunch and back down. Don't let your feet rest on the floor, you're going to immediately go back up. That way you engage your core muscles the whole time. So as you go up and lower back down. And then you have to use it again to go up and down and hold it there. You can start. Engage your lower abs as you come back up. 
Otherwise, you're just going to be feeling it in your upper abs. So you want to make sure that you lower down your feet as possible. Like even that, I can feel my, my lower ab muscles working. So you want to lower down, just touch with your tippy toes and then use your lower abs to push you back up. You can start. So 
This is your last exercise, so we're going to do a little bit of a burn out, so you're not going to rest between your sets. So you can do your right side again, and start. Bring your arm up and stretch towards the side and down.
knees sit on you. All fours. You're going to do a cat cow, so first you're going to round your back. comments below and remember to give this video a thumbs up also remember to subscribe to my channel health ignite fitness you can see this little subscribe button just click on it and i will see you guys tomorrow for a chest and a back workout i will see you guys soon bye